Greetings, hi, the War Owl greets you. There are some smokes in Counter-Strike that you use nearly every round. They're not only useful, but necessary for taking certain positions. These are the top five smokes you need to know to play Counter-Strike Global Offensive. Number five, Train. The B-Site Lower Entry Smoke. Entering into bombsite B-Lower is nearly impossible without this smoke. As you walk down the ramp, your feet are visible before you even get a chance to shoot. This smoke gives you a fighting chance, blocking off the long distance so you can enter into the site. To throw, first peek the corner to make sure a CT isn't peering up your skirt. Then aim in between the door frame and the bottom of the stairs and throw. You can throw a flash too, hug the right wall, and when you get to the bottom, peek to make sure nobody's on top of the train looking down your top. This is officially the end of the pervy metaphors. Whoa! Number four! Dust two, the long A smoke to cross. When planning a tank on bombsite A, it's usually a good idea to push at long at the same time, dividing the enemy's attention. The problem, an incredibly long range gauntlet that's visible from middle. This smoke allows your team to cross into A site, which is essential, especially if the bomb player is at long. To throw, line up that brown bottom trim in the concave part of the red sign. Then aim at the bottom right, a little bit right of the red sign, hold your crosshair there, and do a running throw. There's always going to be a gap in the smoke. The gap should be on the far side, Gary Larson style, closest to A site. The reason for this is so that the player can't see you enter behind the smoke and then predict where you'll be and shoot you through the smoke, which is an easy shot for a competent opera. Please mind the gap. Number three. Oh yeah. Cash. A site forklift smoke. A site on cache is wide open from a plethora of long range angles. You can remove many of the most difficult of these with a single smoke. Whoa, pros hate them. This one simple smoke will improve your Counter-Strike game 30%. This allows players from door to be safe from highway, as well as players A main to be safe from truck. This smoke is your bread and butter for taking A site. To throw, walk up to the second graded door in A main Aim at the left side of the box and do a walking throw. That's holding shift and throwing while walking. Number four, Mirage, the A site smokes. So this one isn't a single smoke, but I felt it necessary to include because they kind of go hand in hand and you're gonna have a really bad time trying to take A site if you don't know these. Nothing is more frustrating than being matched with a team that doesn't know these smokes. First, the jungle smoke. To throw, move to the second concave windowy masonry thingy and stand in the direct center. Aim at this crack in the masonry and move upward until your crosshair is in between these two blocky things. Lots of thingies, and then throw. Make sure you have a teammate watching A main so a CT doesn't push through and get an easy kill. Next, the stairs smoke. Jump on the first step and look directly at the trim. Then aim your crosshair in the center of mass of this geometric shape and throw. It goes bouncy bouncy and lands on the top of stairs, completing the block off of jungle and connector. And finally, the CT spawn smoke. This one's a little bit more tricky, so I made up a new reproducible way to do it without using a jump throw script. To throw, line up this corner in between these two bricks, aim at the center of these bricks, move your crosshair up until it's at the top of the sun, and do a walking throw, letting go when the other building is no longer visible. It seems pretty complicated, but once you do it a few times, you will get the hang of it. This only works at a certain time of day, though, because you have to line it up with the sun. So it's a good thing that Mirage is frozen in a time portal. And finally, number five, Inferno. The CT spawn smoke for a B site tank. This smoke is an absolute necessity when taking bombsite B, which is why I placed it so highly on this list. It cuts off any rotate players and anybody who's playing on the right side, so you just have to focus on the site and on spools. You can throw a spool smoke as well. Keep in mind, players can still stewie 2k their way out of the smoke, and rotate players still can shoot through it, but it's still a must throw for bombsite B. To throw, stand in the corner of the wood pile, aim up at the chimney, and move your crosshair up until you're below the top wire. This is the easiest one to throw. Then throw. Throw, like scumbag CS pros trying to make a quick buck. Wait, did I just go 54345? Can't even do a top 10 list right. I'm a failure. Not only as a YouTuber, but as a human being. Farewell, my friends. I am the War Al, and I still have no closer.
five four three four five four three. Wait, I I did this joke like three years ago, but I don't think anyone's gonna notice.